that Nick and Joe um, came to them with a deal mm -hmm. to try and specifically target the five of us sitting mm -hmm. right here. Mm -hmm. And the idea being, we'll you know, protect your cronies, you protect our cronies, we'll put up the middle people, no one will care, we'll put mm -hmm. one of them up against Dick, we'll send that person home, and mm -hmm. the next week we'll put two more of them mm -hmm. up and send one of them mm -hmm. home again. Mm -hmm. Jen was the one who turned down the deal, mm -hmm. Nick is the one who approached her with it. Mm -hmm. Let's just all file that one away. Mm -hmm. Hmm. So if it is double eviction week, who are the two people that would be put up tomorrow? Because that is a possibility now. In the event of, yeah. Like Name your people right now. Well, Zach and Kale. Zach and Kale are a pair, and then... Yeah. Again. Zach and Kale, boom. They're, I mean, if it's a double eviction week, they're still going to be a POV. Yeah, they have right. to be, yeah. Well, I know, but it's so Name Your People on the Spot. But I think Zach and Kale... Need the to nominations. Go Zach and Kale need to go oh. up tomorrow first. Right, okay. Then then we'll then we'll backdoor Nick. Oh, wait, if it's a double eviction week, we'll backdoor Nick then, at that point, at POV, in lieu of it. And then we'll put up Zach and Kale. Zach and Kale again. <laughs> yeah. Cool. <laughs> and with Jen as a backdoor on that last one. Mm hmm. Okay. I'm down. This meeting is adjourned. Boom. Stamped. Stamped. You okay? You think like you look like your wheels are turning? No, I just, I mean. Yeah, that's fine. No, yeah, what, are you, what are you thinking? No, I'm just, I'm thinking in my head that there are more people here. I, this is my personal opinion. I do not feel um, whatever with Jen. I think that she could be the last one to go as opposed to, you know what I mean, the top one within the top three. Um, I don't know. That's just, that's just my thoughts. And it's kind of like, I guess y'all presented it that way, and that's fine. I just think that definitely um, with that first shake on, that um, you have observed with my, um, the three guys. Oh, and evidently like, there was a second one. I only witnessed one, but evidently there was a second one in the storage room And as how well. forthcoming of them to tell you. <clears throat> okay, let's... I actually agree with Jamika. Personally, I'm very nonplussed by uh, Jen and her game. And yeah, I agree. Eh, whatever. I mean, she, she's fine. She hasn't, she's come down off of some she, of her insanity. Yeah, and right. She doesn't have that much cooking. I would personally think that Kale... Nick and Zach are of greater precedence. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, I would call them the well. big three mm -hmm. for sure. See, Definitely. I put Zach on the back corner. I put Jen mm. in front of Zach. If you had, mm. if you put in priority one, two, three, four, who's going to be number one? Nick. Nick. Okay. I would definitely agree? agree. I agree. Mm -hmm. Nick who's and number two? He, he has really shown a uh, whole other ball game this side. week. Yeah, two the, kale. Two, you think is kale? Two kale, fine. Me personally, I would say Zach over kale. Really? I, I'm just, that's just on a personal. I think Jen should be the first thing. one in the jury. Well, personally, <laughs> I, I have you. no interest I, in Zach. Honestly, he's, he's told me. Outwardly Jamaica, clear, he hates all of us. And he's told me. He's nah. told me from last week. He said and he, he thought he was safe because you know. And when look, I win the my veto, you'll Danielle. <laughs> he wants Danielle out of here. He wants you out of here. He wants you out so he can have unicorn to him. I don't like Zach and sequester. Neither do I. I, I, I want to be able to shower and sequester. If I go to sequester, I will say, go be in prison for murder. Can I just say that at that point, <laughs> you not. can literally tell him to go fuck himself, yeah. in the words of E.D. and uh, Eric, and be done with it. <laughs> he was lumbering yeah. around. He was away from me. You don't and understand. that's wrong. <laughs> he made a stink about the, this afternoon. He tried to, <laughs> we were sitting in oh, the he wasn't room, included and he came in. Away. Well, must have been some great talk up there. Yeah, as, I, I said this. As far oh, as yeah, I oh said, yeah, he made I a said, threat to me on I the said, chess board. I said, too. Zach, people are entitled to speak with whoever they like to speak to. At the time our conversation was going on, there was other conversations in the kitchen. There was other conversations in the backyard. Um, I appreciate, um, you know... <laughs> The thought so that we think that we were doing was so important that this is, should be of great concern to you. But to tell you the honest truth, it had nothing to do with you, and um, it really wasn't any big fucking deal. You're making it into a big fucking spectacle of yourself mm -hmm. right now. Just come off of it. We were having a conversation, and we wanted to finish the conversation. Mm -hmm. Get a grip. Happen is basically what I said to him. Mm -hmm. and, Jamaican. And, and, mm -hmm. and he was like, but... You know, uh, people are always talking and I'm not a part of it. And I'm thinking to myself, 
He's, You're the one who's approaching people 30? with the most full shit things. I can't things. even fathom that this Love man anyone. is 30 years old. Well, let me ask I you something. Even... Jamaica, Amber, yeah, oh my gosh. Jessica, God. has he ever approached any of you with a you single offer deal, strategic 